And I do believe that we have rotten, rotten politics, and I'm, I'm not using that as an exaggeration. Hey everyone and welcome. In this video we're going to be having a look at the meteoric decline of Piers Morgan. Now as you're probably aware Piers Morgan has now got his own show and it's on Talk TV which is aired in the UK and in America. So he's got a massive audience straight away. This is run by Fox so he comes with a large viewership. Now if you didn't know one of the first interviews he had was with Trump and he got 400,000 viewers for it nearly. Large amount isn't it? And now obviously the ego that is Piers Morgan decided he would love to tell the world how much better he is than everybody else at doing the job. Well, it seems, it seems, it was very short-lived. Within two days, which is the time between the Trump interview and his next show, Piers Morgan Uncensored, the viewership dropped nearly 50%. Less than 215,000 people viewed the second show. So it went so gloriously, his interview, or his, should I say, smear job of Donald Trump, that even his already established viewership, i.e. Fox viewership, wouldn't watch him again. <laughs> now, it does look as well that that's not the end of it either. It's going to go down even more, and I'll tell you why. The people that they've got lined up as guests, i.e. to be interviewed, are now starting to drop by the wayside because of his handling, shall we say, or mishandling of the ex-president Donald Trump interview. Now, no one wants to go on his show, so it's only going to get worse. So much so that they're actually discussing what to do about it, the, the, the higher ups than him, and whether they can keep it going. They also tried a desperation move by putting Tucker Carlson on his show. Unfortunately, that didn't bring in the numbers that would save, I would say, Piers Morgan's career. But it looks like he won't be in talk TV for long. If his numbers keep dropping like that, he's a gun duck. He's a gun. He's a gunner. He's going to be out the door quicker than you can fart his first name. <laughs> and it couldn't happen to a nicer guy, could it really? I'm gloriously happy about this. I'm going to have my popcorn. I'm hoping it do, it ends quickly for him, considering he's such a toxic person in <laughs> in general. But I'd like to know your opinion, everyone. Let me know what you think. Don't forget to share it out, everyone. Stay sane. See you on the next one.